Okay, keep going. Just follow your own class. Very good. Very good. Good. That's it. We have one, one more, one more learning ticket. So what's happening here? Very good. <laughs> Does that remind you of a lecture now? But this is what goes on, right? You're confused half the time. But you see, that's the point. That is normal communication. You're confused at the end of it, right? You're like, what else is going on? Half of you are like looking around and like. Uh, <laughs> you see, that's the point, right? Like, not everybody is on board, and that is very normal. But you know, you'll also notice something very interesting. Every time I end up clapping to him or her, right? And he ends up clapping to him. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? But again, right, you start seeing patterns. Some people are just tuned in, right? Some are not. And it's not a fault, but you see, he's just enthusiastic and he finds that fellow enthusiastic. <laughs> and what he does, interestingly, is he looks around here, and everybody's like looking at him and <laughs> yeah, and then it breaks down again, right? And it's just, just funny. And it's same with this zone. So somehow it goes here and then everybody's looking around. <laughs> you know? And then also, the other important thing is clarity, right? So when you get your clap, you need to know who you're giving your clap back to. See what I'm saying? Like, so, so the issue here is like, you get a clap, and then, let me give it away, right? No, 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 it's not how it works. It's two way. So like, just like you receive the clap, the same way you look and you do this and then you pass it back to me and then I look at you and then and then pass back. So, so let's try an exercise, right? All you're gonna do is pass the clap back back to me. Let's see where we go. things you can learn on Google. 
So the most important thing, the most important focus here, right, is not so much on on a great presentation, how can you be like Steve Jobs, but much more on the fundamentals. Just tell me more about yourself. What do you say? Do you say, uh, uh, my name is Rohan, I, I do computer engineering. Um, uh, yeah, yeah. So my, yeah, yeah. But you know, this is a presentation, right? Now, now you, 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 you may like the presentation, not like it, but you're presenting all the time. That is all I need you to get. And it is a lot of it, as you said, is non-verbal, right? So even if I stand like this and give you a great speech, the chances that you're going to be impressed, not so high. Right? You're going to be looking at this and who, who is this guy, right? Like, I mean, you know, standing like this and doing around, right? Or standing like this and saying, you know, my name is Rohan. But you see, there's a lot. It, 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 it's amazing, but, but presentation is such a big word that I'm just trying to break it down. So today, right, our focus is going to be on something very, very simple. So it's going to be on the approach and it's going to be on the concept of your own introduction. Can somebody tell me why I picked your own self-introduction. Guys, you can't be so silent. It's not going to help. You're in a presentation seminar. Present! Tell me, wh why, why a self-introduction? You know yourself the best. You know yourself the best. Very good. More? That's the most frequent thing we do. That's the most frequent thing you do. Good. More? We got two hours. <laughs> <laughs> So we got one and a half, that's sort of why I was looking at you. But, uh, but it's okay, if you want two hours, you can sit here for next oh. time. <laughs> uh, okay, but fair, oh, oh, but why, else, why else have you picked self-introduction? Come on. To break the ice. Huh? Break the ice. To break the ice? Okay, very good. I did not think of that, by the way, but, but it's smart. Well, what else? That's the only thing we know most about immediately when we have Good. The yeah, simple answer is this, right? There's a lot of talk about passion in presentation. And this is a test, right? If you can't be passionate about yourself, I don't know what you will be passionate about, right? So, so I think at the most basic level is that. Now, I'll ask you a different question. The, the title of it was not Killer Presentation. The title of it was Approach to Killer Presentation. Why approach? Still <coughs> now, okay. w Why approach? Silence. Because you're trying to approach our viewers. No. First time I say no, but it's no. Why, why <laughs> approach? Why are we dealing with the approach to a killer presentation? Why are we dealing with an approach to self-introduction? This is something can be learned. Okay, very good. Good answer. More? More? Fundamentals. Very good. Fundamentals. More? Why, why are we doing approach? This is because once you've mastered the approach, you can do it. Brilliant. Give her a high five. Excellent. Give her a hand. So that is correct. That is correct, right? Like, so the reason is once you get approach, you will get everything else. And again, you see, again, what you're seeing here, right, is an approach. Now, one approach could have been, we have 100 slides today. Let's plow it. Let's plow down the slide. Slide number one, prepare in front of the mirror. Slide number two, research Google. This is how you get material for a presentation. Slide number three, da 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 da, right? But what you're seeing is it takes about half an hour for people to even understand why they are here. It takes half an hour to do what's called setting expectations, right? Because at the end of the day, you will walk out saying, you know, I don't know what I learned, right? I learned like 50 points, out of which you'll remember one or two, and if I was really good, you'll remember three. But you don't know how to apply, you don't know how to make use of it. So see, that, that is what we're trying to change, and it, it is extremely difficult, which is kind of what I also want you to realize. This is not easy. The reason I'm also saying it's not easy is because 10 of you are going to get a chance to present, and I'm going to let you choose, let you volunteer. But the fact is that we're going to need a lot of encouragement, a lot of energy, and a lot of clapping around here. The reason is it is not easy. This is not... This is not something I expect people to master in a minute. It takes years and years and lots of practice. Right? So now I need 10 volunteers. 10 people who are brave enough to give this a shot. The important thing is that I, you know, this, is, this is as close group forum as you will get to practice. Right? Think of this just as a practice session. You're going to get a shot at improving your self-introduction. Who would, who, would, 
who are 10 brave souls. Okay, come forward. One, we have two, come forward. Three, come forward. Four, very good, come forward. I need six more. Five, ah, my good friend. Six, seven, eight. Soon you'll have people who'll be like, shit, I wanted to come. <laughs> let me come. Okay, so we're done. Four, five, ten. Okay, good. So now what we're going to do is do the following. So, uh, Abhishek, uh, do we have the flip chart somewhere? Actually, E.B., where are you? Yeah, yeah. Okay, good. Can you, uh, can you get the flip charts out? Yeah? Ah, brilliant. So, just before I get you guys, right? Can you guys just stand to the side? We're going to come to it. So guys, uh, the important thing here, right? I, I, just want, I just want you to know how I came, up, came about this as well. This sort of the process. As you realize, we had to change stuff around because the IT was not before sleeping. Um, this was sort of what I got from your expectations. So what you guys filled in, remember, you said, what is your objective to come to this talk? Now, for the most part, the objective was I want to learn a good presentation, da, 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 right? The usual. Uh, what I found was a few additional words which I wanted to pr bring in. I think some of you may recognize some stuff that you put in, right? So about about six of you said you wanted to conquer fear, build confidence. That was that was one of the things. About seven of you said you wanted to pick the right content and deliver a good message. So that was another. About five of you said you wanted to gain experience, which you're going to get right and gain exposure. And about 14 of you said, how do you impress, make it powerful, make it data. So just so you know, right? So this is sort of the process. This is what you want to, what you want out of this. Uh, what I also heard was a bit of this, right? We have a lot of effective, some empowered, lots of fresh, some how to articulate, and some said, you know, I want to run a killer presentation. So these are sort of the words I saw as I, as I was reading through your, your objectives. Now, I will submit the three principles. Uh, Again, I, I say I will commit to three principles. You sort of realize why principles. Uh, the first one is, you shall be taught how to fish. Uh, what that means is, how many of you know the famous fish Chinese proverb? Okay, say it aloud, somebody. Sorry. Ah, you got the Chinese version. I'm sorry, I don't know Chinese. <laughs> uh, you know, nothing beyond, beyond a few words, but yeah, sorry. English would be great. <laughs> For my sake. Okay, guys. Fish Good. So it's better to teach people how to fish than give person a fish. So what does what does that mean? It means that if maybe some of you have your most of you are first and second years, right? So maybe you have a module to present uh, or present to, or maybe you have an FYP presentation when you're later, right? It's easy to tell you how to fix one presentation. It's harder to teach you what's called the approach to teach you how to approach every presentation you're going to go in. But but that is sort of what I'm committing to. What I'm committing to is just teaching you the approach, right? Next is, again, it, 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 it ties in, but pretty much you'll focus on learning the approach. We are not, we're not here to master one thing. We're not here to be, the, uh, be amazing self-introducers. What, what I, again, we're focusing on is the learning approach, right? Third thing is, you will have a fun, interactive learning session. It's not going to be boring, as you can see, right? And if you're falling off to sleep, I make you stand. Uh, but, but, <laughs> but, but, but no, you'll, you'll just have a fun, interactive learning session. Right? I'll come back to these principles. And you'll see if I have if I've met them at the end of the hour or so. Now, what we are going to do is I am going to give can can you give each of them a, a sheet? You will each go to. So now I want you to cluster in groups. Of, I don't know how many we are, but let's say everybody, everybody gets a sheet. Quickly, 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 pass it on. Are there markers ready as well, Ibi? Yes. Can you get markers? Okay, excellent. So you all have a sheet, right? Just, just pass out the extra sheet. Excellent. You'll uh, each take a marker. Thank you. And we're just going to do this based on location. So you move there. Yeah, go, go, go there literally. You move back there. Take, give a marker. Mark Six of you get together around him. Six of you together as a group. Okay, seven of you. Close. Now, the rest of you, boys. No, it's not a boys versus girls thing, right? So, so all, of, all of you, a bunch of you get, get together around him. So keep, keep moving, right? So form your group. So you, you basically have a group of about five or six. Uh, so that, this is one group. 